Let's learn in this video how to manually trigger a workflow within GitHub Actions that could be useful when we don't want to automatically trigger that workflow. And then we'll learn also how we can add input to that workflow so we can add parameters that will be used within our workflow. So the user experience will be like this one here when I go to choose my pipeline and then I go to run that workflow, I can see here the option to specify a parameter that is person to greet for example and then I can put here the variable that I want to put and then I can go to run the workflow and once it starts running it will take into account that parameter that I have added. Let's see how this works within GitHub. So here I have the definition of that workflow that is available in the GitHub uh, templates. So first here it will set up the trigger to be on workflow dispatch. This means I can trigger manually this workflow and the input actually works only with this uh, workflow dispatch with the manual triggering. So in the input, I can specify one or multiple inputs. I have here an example, which is a name that would have a description. That's going to be the label that will be shown from within the GitHub actions. And then I have the value or the default value that is going to be world. And then uh, whether that uh, Config whether that input is required or not. So if I don't specify anything here, it will tell me, no, please, I cannot trigger the pipeline unless you specify that parameter. So that input is called a name. How can, now, how can I now access that input from within my pipeline? So that's why here we have uh, jobs. We have one job that is called a greet. And within this job, we have a step that is uh, called send greeting. And within this step, we run here the command echo. And from here, we can access that input using this dollar github.event.inputs. The name of my input, which is name right here. So it's as simple as that github.event.inputs, then the name of the input. Let's now go, go to see that action that started running. It's this one here manual input that's gonna uh, it's called a greet the name of the job and then here we see the action send greeting and now it shows me here hello world world is the input that was passed into this uh, workflow so by the way you can find this pipeline available within the github existing template so if you go to actions right here then you go to create a new workflow then you go down right here and you will find a workflow called greetings or the manual workflow, sorry. If you go to configure it, it will create that pipeline for you with all the YAML code right here. I hope you liked this video. Thank you.